Good morning, everyone. Today is a travel day. Dallin is making me show you my system, which is not a system. It's kind of overpacking. I just don't like to forget things. So here we have our diaper box. It's just our normal box of diapers. I literally didn't pack anything. I just keep them in this collapsible boxy thing. So when we travel, I just bring the box. And then I also have all of James's bows, all of our hair stuff in here. She has some eczema right now. We're good to go. That's like the child care box. Lotion, creams, diapers, wipes, bows, hair stuff, all of that. Next we have our dry goods. This is because we're gonna be down there till Tuesday, so that's Saturday, Sunday, Monday, Tuesday. It's like four days. And if we don't have to go shopping, that'd be great. We probably will shop for a few things. That's just all of our dry goods. We have some fruit, we have breakfast, cereal, macaroni, all of that. This is the toy box. A lot of you might say, why are you bringing toys on vacation? I just, we're living there and I just, don't wanna be watching TV all the time, so I wanna have something where I can be like, here, play with this, don't watch TV. Also, we're gonna be working a lot, and we brought Grandma Seely to babysit, so that's kind of her survival kit of toys. She's like a travel genius. You guys need to take notes. These boxes from Ikea have come in such handy, come in such handy lately. Very from Target. From Target? This is Luna, and she's very sad. She knows when the boxes come out that we're gonna be leaving soon. So she sits here and cries, and Dash doesn't know anything yet. But you're so happy. Okay, and then this is our snack survival kit for the car. I always bring these doggy bags. Our kids have this wonderful talent of throwing up every time we travel anywhere multiple times, so that's for clothes if we need it. Cross your fingers, I really hope we don't. They've literally thrown up in the car every trip we've ever taken and then thrown up in our hotel room after that. So we're prepared this time. If you buy these from Costco, these are our favorite snacks for traveling and for every day. Church and traveling, those Bovitas breakfast squares are amazing. And then this is our milk and eggs and juice. It's just nice to be able to get to our Airbnb and not have to go shopping for everything. Snacks are prepared. I'm just trying to clean up and pack everything. I don't have the kids packed yet. I don't have me packed yet. The kids are about to wait up. We were supposed to leave two hours ago. We all kind of knew that was fake though, so we're not stressed. Will you take care of the house while we're gone? Will you take care of everything? <laughs> Are you gonna be okay? Hey, you guys are out here packing everything up. Not only does it feel like we're packing an entire kitchen, but we're also packing an entire recording studio. <laughs> Look at all this stuff. Microphones and cords galore in here. Stands interface slash sound buttons. More stands. The reason we're bringing all of our recording equipment is because we are podcasting with Five to Love down in St. George, and we're podcasting with Crazy Middles down there. They're coming up from Arizona, so we're excited to see them. Maybe we can squeeze somebody else in there. We're doing a little YouTuber collaboration later today where we're all making, did Ashley already tell you about this? We're all making meals and bringing them all together and they will be judged, so that's gonna be fun. So I just gotta pack all this stuff up now and then we're gonna wake the kids up and we're gonna ship out. Let's go! <laughs> We've made it. Ashley found this beautiful house. I like, did. Look at the view here. This is nuts. Look how pretty that is out there. This is my dreamland. So get this. This house right here, which is a normal sized home with three bedrooms, was the same price as this house right here, which has five bedrooms. So I booked it and I was afraid it might be like a bigger house that's not as nice, but it's just as nice. It's just so nice. You freaking nailed it. You found a sweet deal. Look at our yard. The dogs would have loved it here. Aw. All right, guys, it's time for the official tour. We haven't even seen all of it yet either. We just peeked our heads inside through our bags in a room. After this tour, we're gonna rush. I found a really great homemade macaroni recipe. We're gonna go meet up with all those families and do, I don't know what with them, just collab. It's a bunch of other YouTuber families. They're all really big families. We're gonna be the smallest family there. Crazy Middles, I think they have like eight, nine, eighteen kids. Yeah, let's go show them our house. Hey, right this way, folks. <laughs> all right, walking right in to the left, we have the, the Sealy corridors right here. So this will probably be Dallin and I's room. The house is really cool because it has two sections of bedrooms. So there's three right here, which is perfect. We can all be close, but in separate rooms. And then this is James's room. And then we had George on the lower bed. Nice. So when he inevitably rolls off, he'll be okay. James's pack and play will just go here. And she'll Normally, just have a bed. she would go in a bathroom or something so she could have quiet, calm space. This place just has so many rooms, she gets her own. And this is our bathroom, right here. Okay, all right, very, moving on. Very nice. All right, so one of the reasons we came down here was to podcast with some friends here. As we've already told you, Crazy Middles and Five to Love. We're gonna podcast with both of them. So this is the living room where we're gonna set up all of the microphones and the equipment. And we'll all just be sitting right around here podcasting. Make sure that you catch those podcasts on the Big Little Life podcast 
and the Taking Sides podcast. Hopefully I have time to have them on both so that we can talk about marriage as well. But check out this kitchen. Um, so apparently there's toys in the garage. Should we just found them? Check this out. Mom, this is the reason we brought you with us. So that Ashley and I can ride a tandem bike. That'll be fun. We're gonna come here for a family reunion. And then over here it looks like we have bunk beds. And my mom's room will be right there. What the? There's a staircase outside. Oh my gosh, there's a rooftop on our house. Georgie, where are we? Is this Elsa Cat? Is this Elsa's castle, Mom? We climbed up the stairs of her castle. <laughs> Did you see this? This is why I found this place. What in the heck? <laughs> Ash, this is like amazing. I, love this I feel place extravagant. So much. Mom, we're playing ping pong. One, two, ready to hit it? One, two, three. Oh! <laughs> One, two, three. Yeah! One, two, three. <laughs> Okay friends, so we are feverishly making, what do you call it? I doubled the recipe because there's a lot of people there. <laughs> I'm channeling my inner Duggar family or Bates cooking skills. Well check out this pot. This is a pioneer woman. We've never woman. owned a pot this big. Yeah, thank you VRBO for this. Okay, so this is a pioneer woman macaroni and cheese recipe. Just look it up. It was like the top rated one on Google, so I'm using it. It's gonna be good. It's got a whole stick of butter in it, so. Yeah. Of Nelson's house, we're so excited. It's just really fun to like hang out with other YouTubers. So, right now, the people who are here are Not Enough Nelsons, Crazy Metals, Metals, Crazy Pieces, and a YouTube family they're just getting started called Whoa Nelly. Dallin and I are the family with the least amount of children here. Yeah, so you guys many gotta kids check here. them out. They all have crazy, amazing families. So, we got here late, so we didn't do the whole competition. They all did this like amazing top shelf, com top chef competition where they got different foods from different aisles of the store. And had a competition. We did come in clutch with some macaroni though, and it's so fun feeding large families because they, they all eat just, it all. They all just come and scoop it all up. I'm walking around two like trays of mac I am and cheese. such a great chef. There's all you like, have to do is just have like 30 kids in your house, and it, and it goes all the way. We're excited to introduce you to some of them, and we're excited to like have them on our podcast. Have them They're on coming the over. Podcast. So have fun partying with us for a little bit. What's up, you guys? It's the next day. We had so much fun podcasting last night. Here's all of our stuff out in the living room. Sorry, we didn't film anything. We just wanted to be in the moment and podcast. So you'll have to go check out the podcast because it was amazing. We had them on both, Big Little Life and Taking Sides, answering your guys' relationship questions. So you have to go check it out, the podcast with Crazy Middles and Crazy Pieces uh, families. Right now, we just woke up from a nap around here. Hey, Georgie, did you have a good snooze, my bud? No. Yeah, pretty much never. George and James did not sleep that well last night, which is typical for the first night of traveling. So Ashley and I are a little stressed right now, so I made Ashley her favorite thing, and I ordered our favorite drinks. Ship just brought them to our house. You guys, Ship literally is the best travel hack that we have. Sometimes we'll have Ship to deliver things before we even get to our place. Have it there when we're there. Anyways, I already made Ashley nachos. Now I'm bringing her her drink. Here, you guys tell me, do you feel like it's almost a sin to eat chips with partially melted cheese. Okay, I tried my best. I know. Gosh. Hey, listen. I do not hold you responsible for the sins of our microwave. <laughs> this is an appliance I got error. most of them. In a funny turn of events, my parents are coming over to visit. Does anyone else feel like when they go on vacation, somehow their entire family goes on vacation with them? <laughs> Sometimes. Hey, Mom. Hey, Angel. Mom. What's up, Georgie? I want camp play. Grandma can't play with me. Yeah, Is Grandma's sleeping? sleeping, huh? Well, oh. Are you tickling? Oh, he just sees the, the Do you coke. want a little? You can have a little drink. Okay. Because I love you so much. I don't know why, but I just love it when my kids drink soda so much. Look at him what does that mean? It. He swishes it like a fancy person. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, James just woke up. One of our favorite things to do is just to listen to her eat and to watch her eat. She... I just feel like she eats like a grown-up person, and she's so small. James, you're the cutest eater in the whole world. You guys, we've made it to the lights and the dinosaurs. George is ready. Go get all the dinosaurs. What are you gonna say to those dinosaurs, George? Worm. What? Like a tiger. 
You roar at him like a tiger? Hey, I see a dinosaur. You do? Which one is that? That's Negasaurus. Yeah, it is. This is that dinosaur park we come to called Thunder Junction every time we come to St. George. This is the first time this year we're seeing Christmas lights. Aww, are you holding your sister's hand, my bud? He's a little scared. Huh? Are you a little scared? <laughs> yeah. Okay, this is George's favorite slide in the world and every time we come here he does it a hundred times. This is a pretty big dinosaur head. Guys, look how pretty the sky is. It's purple. Del, the sky's purple in the camera. Here we go. <laughs> <laughs> I can climb. Good job. I'm going to do it all by myself. Okay. Cheer him on in the comments, guys. Okay, Nerve's got to him. He's going with Dad. <laughs> yeah. You did it! You did it all by yourself. Well, let's see. Let me do it again. Everyone cheer. Look what I did it! Wow. <laughs> Okay, who remembers this swing? James did it last time we came to St. George with the five to love quiz. She goes super zen when she's riding it. <laughs> Do you like that? Are you happy? She wishes that her bed did this. All right, you're doing okay. All right, you guys, thanks for joining us on our first day of our little trip to St. George. We're gonna meet up with Five to Love tomorrow, do podcasts with them, hopefully hang out for a little bit. Excited to see them in the next vlog. Make sure to check out the podcast we did with Crazy Middles and Crazy Pieces and Five to Love. That'll be out short, hopefully when this vlog comes out or shortly thereafter on Big Little Life. Just search Big Little Life with the Dashleys wherever you listen to podcasts, like on Spotify, Apple Podcasts, Anchor, Stitcher, Google Podcasts. Those are the biggest ones, um, lots of other places. Go check it out and just listen to us on your next drive. When you're working out, when you're at work, anywhere, it's just fun to hang out and we've really been interviewing a lot of cool guests lately on the podcast, so it's a really fun way to pass the time. Thanks guys, as always, we love you. We'll see you next time. Bye.